Hi, hello, I just woke up, pretty much. Well, maybe like an hour ago. Um, it's day two of me being back home and we're gonna do some more things today. Currently now getting ready um, because I have the whole day planned, pretty much. I'm pretty excited about today. This is what I imagine my whole trip back home would be like, just like every day is completely planned. I'm meeting thousands of people, okay, literally thousands, like four. I'm meeting loads of people all the time and just literally just like talking to everybody the whole the whole day, which, which is what I love to do because I'm reuniting with my friends, hello. It's actually like eight o'clock in the morning and the reason I've woken up so early is because, well, I'm meeting a lot of people today, as I already said. The first person I'm meeting today, he kind of invited me over for breakfast, which I think is so cute. Like, I love having breakfast with my friends. I don't know why. I feel like it's just like underappreciated and breakfast is such a nice time. And, you know, just like morning, you're like, your brain is fresh. You're not like stressed or anything. You just have your coffee. You just, you know, have whatever you like. I don't know. I just really like having breakfast with my friends. I'm going to cycle over to his, which is literally like maybe, will probably take me like an hour to cycle there, but I love cycling. I probably won't vlog a lot today because purely for the fact that I'll probably just most of the time will be talking to other people, but I'll do my best. I'll, I'll see how it goes and then I'll see you later. <laughs> Oh yeah, whoops, I forgot to record. Um, it's already like 12 p.m. Two beers, two cocktails down, and we're going out tonight. <laughs> um, yeah, it's been a full day and I'm ready to continue the full day. El Lego. Hi, good morning. Um, it's day four, I think, of my being back home um, trip or whatever. And today I'm in. Boom! I think that's the, the sun is making me sneeze. Wait, let me go somewhere else. And today I'm in my countryside. I came, I came here yesterday, but yesterday I was very hungover from Friday, so I didn't film anything. But I'm here and I'm having a great time. Very calm, very peaceful. It's good. I always love being here. It's, it's always the best. I also forgot to mention that I did not bring my phone charger. Not on purpose, obviously, but I forgot to bring my phone charger here. Um, and I came here yesterday with like 15%. So my phone is now dead, um, which is honestly the best thing that could happen. I haven't been on my phone the whole day, but it's giving me good time to cleanse from my phone. Probably not gonna use my phone until the very end of the day. And I love it. I already love it.
Hi, good morning. It is day five back home. And today my plan is just to go through shops, help my mom out with something, try to fix my computer fully because it's still not 100% not fixed. I need to upload a video because it's Monday. And I don't know, I feel like this, is, this day is gonna fly by really fast and I don't think I'm gonna vlog a lot of it because it's not gonna be very interesting. I'm most definitely going to karaoke with my dad tonight, so I'll probably vlog some of it, some of that. But um, other than that, it's gonna be a rather boring day for a vlog. Um, but it's gonna be a pretty cool day for me, so. Hope you have a nice day. Catch you on the flip side. leaving soon day five day six i don't know who's counting by now i feel very fresh today i don't know why i was in karaoke yesterday obviously you guys saw probably i put, probably put some kind of clip in there and i had to meet up with my best friend and we had breakfast together at nine i could not wake up it was very difficult but now i feel very fresh these seven eight days i'm here that's all i'm doing i'm literally just constantly meeting people and just like chatting and you know catching up with everybody also oh it's a very sunny day it's literally suddenly summer like it was so cold a few days ago um and then this week it's super warm i was wearing a uh i was wearing a sweater before and then i came back home and i was like i need to change nope this is not going like i i can't go out like this this is too warm so yeah I've, i'm just here i've changed into a t-shirt i'm sorry i just got really tired just sitting like that <laughs> Everything's good. Everything's Gucci. Hope you're doing well. As, hope you're doing well as well. Hope you're doing well as well. Is that as, that is a say? I mean, that's not a saying, but you can say that, can't you? Anyway, see ya. Hi. Good morning. It's already 1 p.m., but it's the last day of me being back home. A few things I could say about this trip so far that I've realized. First of all, I don't think, I don't know how I feel about seeing people that I know all the time. I know so many people from here and like Riga in general is so small. Everybody knows everyone somehow, which I do not really like. Like yesterday I was walking in the old city center and just like the previous president of Latvia literally just like walked by and I was like never seen you just like walking around like that before completely alone by himself just regularly you know having a nice day or whatever like it's kind of cool from one side but on the other hand I'm like I don't know how I feel about that like I like to see people that I know I like to you know I like to feel like I know the place I like to be like oh hi oh hi oh hi but then again I don't really, I don't really like small talk that much. So when I'm doing something, when I'm like, I don't know, running late or something, I don't like to see like people that I know because I don't want to stop. And I'm just like, you know, what do I do? Do I say hi? Do I just like pretend like I didn't see them? And it's always awkward. I don't like to be like, I don't like to see people that I'm not supposed to see. You know what I mean? If I went to, you know, just like visit my old school and I saw like my old teachers, I'd just, I'd stop and talk because I'm there to see them, you know? That, like kind of. But when I'm like walking down the street and I'm walking with a friend, I'm clearly there with my friend. And if I see a teacher that, that like that used to be my teacher, I don't want to stop and I don't want to talk to them because it's not, you know, it wasn't the plan, you know what I'm saying? Like, even though it was spontaneous and all, but it doesn't feel right for me. I have some mixed feelings about that. Um, but I've really loved my time back. It's, it feels completely different. It's, di it's, it's so weird how, I think I said this the last time I was, I came back home. Um, I feel like I'm living two lives because when I come back here, I feel like I'm living the life that I used to live when I, you know, when I didn't, 
live in the UK. Like, I feel like I'm back in kind of like high school vibes and like, or, you know, after I graduated, that kind of vibe, you know, living with my mom, sister. I don't know, it just, it just feels different. When I go back to the UK, I feel completely independent. I do what I want, I do what I like. Everything is how I like it, you know, because I have my own space. I don't have a lot of stuff. But everything I have is, you know, serves a purpose and it's uh, it's just different. It's just so, so much different back in the UK. I have so much free time in the UK, always. But I'm never bored. This is also like a fact about me because I, I think I once read this somewhere, I don't know where. And it stuck with me and I still keep this kind of mindset. You only get bored in life if you are boring. And because of that, I never get bored. I didn't used to ever get bored, I don't think. I always find something to do. This is the thing, like, everybody always, not everybody, but like, a lot of people ask me, like, what do you do in your free time? Like, in back in the UK, on Saturday, on Sunday, and I'm like, I don't know, but I'm never bored. I literally always have something to do, always. I don't know what really was the point of saying this. It's just different, it's just different. I guess it's obvious that it's different, you know? It's, it's I don't, that, that's the reason why I moved away, for it to be different. That's what I wanted and that is what I'm very grateful for. I love that I'm, I love that I can feel two different lives and still be me, you know? Still have everything working out. I think I should stop talking and do something. <laughs> I'm leaving tomorrow. I'm not sure if I'll vlog tomorrow. Maybe I will, we'll see, I don't know. But if not, then bye. If yes, then see you in the next clip. <laughs>